Today we're going to be upgrading the MEF on the track card in the GCP4000. To accomplish this procedure, you'll need a laptop with DT installed on it, a straight 9-pin serial cable, the track card MEF software, and the quick reference guide. To get started, you'll need to plug the serial cable into the serial port of the track card you want to upgrade. During today's procedure, the crossing system will be inoperable. You need to take alternate means to warn the public. Before we get started today, we'll need to verify the track MEF that is in the module at this time. So click on main, classic DT, CFG file. Create reports. Reports are created, CFG file, view software info. Convert that to a text format. Now scroll down to your track card. GCP 03 underscore 20 is what is running in the unit now. You'll need to verify the replacement MEF is compatible with the currently installed MCF. And to accomplish that, you will use the software compatibility chart. OK, so let's get started. We'll go to COM install software. Are you sure? Yes. Now we hit F4, change MEF, erase the MEF, yes. At this time you have 70 seconds to find the MEF and start the procedure. Today we're going to upgrade to GCP 03 underscore 40. This procedure will take approximately eight to 10 minutes. Okay, the blue bars are almost complete, so we're getting towards the end of the procedure. Now you'll wanna hit F8 to exit the setup. And now you can sit here and watch it go through and reboot and verify that everything comes up. Now that the procedure is complete, you'll need to recalibrate your track card. 